Hello everyone, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Patrick and Partners along with Bob Icino. Let's check in and dash. We haven't looked at it in a little bit. Came off our key GAN levels. Retraced up, got above the rotation zone. Backfilled, got above the rotation zone and the first cross. Then we formed this double. I have these lines marked off for a reason. Let me just update these first levels. For if we push lower, we're pushing against the daily rotation zone. Now we have the, again a cross back down. This is a double cross principle, which means we've had a light, larger correction on the next higher time frame when we see this double cross. So we're now going to watch for some lower prices, uh, minor lower prices. You can just do a projection. Easy the thing to do is a reverse GAN box, which takes you to 454 and 444. And any rallies, you know, back especially up to the 500, that's key resistance. If we do get through there in 521, let me show you why I have these vertical lines marked. We talk about a reversal pattern at a location. So this was a double top on the four hour chart, which came down and hit the full target. Let me show you on the daily. This is what I mean at a location. So if we look at the daily, we were just spiking into the rotation zone. So that's the location. Here's the left side of the double top. Here's the right side that I marked off. You can see we're right up. We're poking through the eight and then we collapse down. That's what we mean by multi time frames putting them together. So if you were long on something buying in here and you did see a double top forming that then triggers against the rotation zone on the daily chart, either move up your stop aggressively or lighten up because most likely it's heading lower and you can look to add back on either at a bottoming pattern or even at some of the targets for the double top and then you've you know you've got your price back on lower now you can see if we do get below this uh, 475 level well then we'll be watching for this 454 and 444 and if we do break down to new lows because we have the overhead pressure of the rotation zone we will be watching for about 410 then major major cluster at 387 now if for some reason we have a major rally, the key resistance now is coming in about between 556 and 566. You see the two GAN levels and the top of the declining rotation zone there. So that would be major resistance on a rally. That's what we have for you on this Dashcoin update, and we'll talk to everyone soon. Bye for now.